Hi students, uh, this is Manram Krishna. Now in this class we are going to discuss about the high voltage engineering chapter 1 breakdown in gases. Okay, in that topic we have the Parsons law. Okay, so how it's the what is the Parsons law? Okay, how it is working? So Parsons law. So why it is working? Okay, Parsons law. What is Parsons law? Okay, what is the derivation of the Parsons law that we are going to discuss now? So Parsons law, okay. So it is uh, so the sign is Parsons. So he studied of the breakdown of voltage of different gases. Okay. So he studied the breakdown of voltages of different gases. Okay, he studied the breakdown voltage of different gases of dielectrical materials. And so he also discovered of the what is the okay as that so here what happened so as the pressure is increasing okay so as the pressure and the distance as the pressure and distance is varied in between the two electrodes the dielectric strength or voltage okay the breakdown voltage also is varying okay that is how studied by the Parsons law and here so here the Parsons law is that okay it said that breakdown voltage okay so here is the it said that so breakdown voltage breakdown voltage is the function of product of breakdown voltage is a function of product of pressure and distance okay so breakdown voltage is a function of product of pressure and distance okay so here is that this is the Parsons law so breakdown voltage V is the function of the product of pressure and the distance this is the Parsons law so and if you considering the different class okay in the previous classes we are having the thousands okay so in the thousands theory so whatever the difference is there okay so I said about the only uh, primary ionization and secondary ionization matter okay but it's not uh, considering the different parts of the that is pressure and distance okay so it is pressure and distance is uh, varied okay how direct strength okay direct material strength how it will be varied and breakdown voltage how it is appeared okay that is one another now he is the Parsons law in that so he stated about the whatever the pressure and distance is varied in between the two electronic uh, plates so if the pressure and distance is varied the breakdown voltage also varied okay so from that one he say that so Parsons law is nothing but breakdown voltage is the function of product of okay breakdown voltage is the function of product of pressure and distance breakdown voltage is, is a function of pressure and distance okay so this is about the passion so is uh, here the one or the graph is there for passion flow so we have uh, read the different laws of the different gases he studied the different gases so let us consider the one of the yes okay so if considering the so CO2 also is a one of the dielectrical material okay so here consider so here we have taken the in the x-axis breakdown voltage in the y-axis pressure and distance okay breakdown voltage pressure and distance so here we draw the curve so it will be like this so breakdown voltage and pressure and distance so if you draw the graph for the CO2 direct committee, so that will be like that. So here, this curve is called as a Parsons curve. Okay, this curve is called as a Parsons curve. So here, whatever the voltage is, okay, so here is that, this point. So if you uh, forward it to the y-axis, okay, if it goes to the y-axis, what happened? This voltage is called as the 
minimum voltage okay this voltage is called as the minimum voltage so what minimum voltage means so v minimum for breakdown okay minimum breakdown voltage okay it's nothing but it is whatever the value is comes to the y axis that value is the minimum breakdown voltage value okay this is about the passive so so we are having the derivations for passive law so how it is the v is a function of the product of pressure and distance okay how it is came okay that we have to going to discuss now so in the passive law so here the he studied the different gases of the dielectric medium and he is discovered that so as the pressure and distance increases the breakdown voltage also varies so from that one he said that breakdown voltage is the function of product of pressure and distance so from that one breakdown voltage is equal to function of product okay function of product of pressure and distance so is the pressure of the gas distance with the two electron plates okay two plates are two uh, conductors okay if considering so whatever they we are considering so and here if we draw the graph between the oh, breakdown voltage and pressure and distance so the graph will be like this so whatever the graph is there it comes so curve that curve is called as a passions curve here if it is coming to the towards the y axis that is the minimum voltage of breakdown so that is the minimum voltage for breakdown so this is about the passions law and if you coming to the derivation let us considering the torsion theory so from the torsion theory we are having the secondary ionization process from that one we will take the value so from the torsion criterion so we have the torsion breakdown criteria and the previous class we discussed about the torsion breakdown criterion so from that one gamma is the e power of alpha d minus 1 is equal to 1 okay so we have stated the what happens with the alpha d gamma values it varies with the less than 1 greater than 1 equal 1 okay that way so here we considering that so from the torsion criteria we have the that is gamma is equal to e power of alpha d minus 1 is equal to 1 okay let us consider this the equation 1 so here what happen if the breakdown voltage okay from this one so we can say that so if, uh, this one this equation that is break on torsion criteria so it is enables the evaluation of breakdown voltage of the gap of the use of the approximate values of alpha okay so in the torsion breakdown so it is not discussed about the whatever the pressure and okay pressure and distance we are discussed but here state the sum of the value uh, is comes to the that is alpha is directly proportional to e by p okay here yeah, okay sir. and so that we are going to consider in the again okay so if it is enables the so this value okay alpha sorry gamma e power of alpha d minus 1 is equal to 1 okay this is the torsion criterion so enables the evaluation of breakdown voltage of the gap by the use of the appropriate values of the alpha by p okay by the use of the appropriate alpha by p let us write here so what is the uh, gamma is that e power of gamma into e power of alpha d minus 1 is equal to 1 okay so it is enables the evolution of breakdown voltage of gap by the use of appropriate values of the alpha uh, gamma by b okay sorry alpha by p and gamma corresponding to the values of electrical field and pressure when the current is too low to damage the cathode and also the space charges distorted to the minimum okay so we are considering this is well for the here so whenever the e by p okay so e by p is there so that is when the too low okay to damage the cathode so is the space charges also distort the minimum so we are doing the electrostatic so electrical field and pressure so that we are going to considering now in the torsion's equation we are did not considering the uh, electrical field and pressure now we are considering the passion flow that is electrical field and pressure 
let us consider in the also okay so we are considering the from that equation so here we are considering the the function okay the function of field strength and gas pressure in terms of okay so field pressure and gas in terms of okay so we are considering the e and pressure they are considering in terms of the values okay so in the function that will be we can write it as alpha by p is equal to function of e by p okay so from this one so we can write it as e is equal to p into f of e by p okay so here the alpha is equal to p into f of e by p so it is a f is a function of electrical field by pressure so we are considering this equation from the derivative so by considering the electrical pressure and sorry electrical field and pressure in the ionization process from that equation we are considering the okay primary ionization and secondary for that one here our ionization coefficient from alpha by p is equal to function of electrical field by pressure okay okay here we are considering the alpha is equal to pressure into function of electrical field by pressure okay so in the, we are going to substitute these values in the equation one so we can written as this equation so we can change the equation two so if we substitute the equation two in equation one okay so it will be like this gamma of e power of gamma into e power of pressure into function of e and p into distance minus 1 is equal to 1 okay so by solving this one we can get e power of pressure into function of e by p into d minus 1 is equal to 1 by gamma okay by the concluding the equation e is equal p into d function of e by p okay so we are considering this one is considering to in the ls2 rhs side and we can write as a one okay we can writing as a a into d power of p in p d into function of e by p is equal to 1 by gamma plus 1 okay now we go so here we are considering the taking the so we are considering here taking both sides line here we are considering the both side line okay sorry yeah line okay consider the line on both sides so it will be line e power of p into d into f of e by p is equal to lan 1 by gamma plus 1 okay so here we are considering this value as a k as a constant and from this one here we are writing as a f of e by p into pressure and distance okay we are considering this is as a f of e by p into pressure and distance equal to k so here is a k is the constant so for uniform field okay so here we are considering that for uniform field okay for uniform field e is equal to okay electrical field e is equal to volt by okay volt by distance electrical field e is equal to volt by distance okay from that one so we can written as the we can written as f of so we are going to substitute this value f 
एफ ऑफ बी बाई डी ओके एफ ऑफ बी बाई डी बी बाई डी ओके वी आर कंसिडरिंग दी सो ही आर वी सब्सट्रैक्ट दी वैल ई वैल्यू इन दिस वन सो ही कैन वी कैन राइट एन एज ए ई ऑफ v by d into pressure okay pressure into distance is equal to k okay f of v by d into pressure is equal to k by pressure into distance okay so this from that one we can considering the so we can easily write an as this one as okay so we are written as this one v is equal to okay voltage v is equal to function okay here is the considering the function a of product of pressure and distance okay we can return as a this one or we can write it so this is the passion flow derivative so let us we can to in the again going to once again so here we are considering the form thousands criterion so we are considering the thousands criterion so here from the thousands criterion what we are doing so gamma is the e power of alpha d minus 1 is equal to 1 okay and we are considering the here uh, ionization coefficient from the ionization coefficient of for the primary ionization coefficient okay that is the e by alpha by okay so alpha by is the by p is equal to function of electrical pressure and so electrical field and pressure and from that one we are going to substituting this value in the thousand criterion from that one we are getting the this equation so here by taking the exponential okay so we are getting so considering the lan and the both sides okay from that one we are substituting the values of the uh, lan okay so from the lan equations we are getting the uniform field that is uh, here so for we are considering the for uniform field e is equal to volt by distance from that one so we are substituting the e value v by d in this one here from this one we getting the f of v by dp okay so voltage by distance to pressure is equal to k by pd okay this is about the passens law so from that one we can say that so whatever the voltage breakdown voltage is so it is a function of product function of product of pressure and distance okay this is about the passens so in the passens law we can considering the different fields so whatever the uh, negative is there from the thousand criterion so it is not discussed in the that is electrical field and pressure so from that one so we not said and limitations are there okay from limitations from in the passens law we can easily get the whatever the distance between the two pellets or two electrodes are okay so what are the contacts in between the two dielectric material okay so in between the so if it is pressure and distance it varies so the breakdown voltage also varies okay that is uh, discovered by the passen law okay this is about the passens law and so we have different types of the passens uh, for di uh, for different values of the gases for different gases different dielectrical strengths will be there and we having the different values so we have also uh, discussed about the what is the uh, passens law curve okay how it is varying so how what is the minimum voltage value okay this is about high volt injury okay so thank you this is manram krishna is signing off have a good day